Hello students, how are you? I hope you have learned about the different types of food and food habits of animals. Different types of animals have different types of food habits. Different types of foods are eaten by different people in different part of the world. Now we are at the end of this chapter and at the end we are going to discuss about food chain. So what is food chain? A food chain is a sequence which shows how living things in an environment are related to each other according to their feeding habits. All the food chains always begins with plants. As you know that plants are producers. Already we have discussed that only green plants have ability to produce their own food by the process of photosynthesis. Not any other animals or non-green plants. So always in a food chain we can see that the food chain started with green plants. In a food chain, green plants are eaten by a herbivore, means any herbivore. And after that, those herbivores are eaten by any carnivore and then these carnivores are eaten by top level of carnivores so food chain is like a chain system means for on first level it will be always green plants after that primary consumer that is a herbivore after that secondary consumer, that is a carnivore. After that tertiary consumer, that is top level of carnivore. Here I am going to explain it with an example. Have you seen a crop field like uh, corn, wheat, etc. Always rats, basically mouse, big mouths are present in the crop field. Why? They have to they have their food to that crop. I am just showing you a picture that corn is eaten by mouse. After that, that mouse is eaten by snake. That snake is secondary consumer. And that secondary consumer is eaten by owl and that owl is at the top level and that is known as tertiary consumer. So in this way, this food chain is going on in the environment and you can see that all animals depend on plants directly or indirectly for their food. And if any herbivore will not there, then carnivore will also die. And if plants will not there, then herbivore will die. So indirectly, all are linked with each other. So this connection between the plants, herbivores and carnivores are called as food chain. Thank you, students. In next video, I will be with you with some assignment. Just wait for tomorrow. Thank you.